Mike, we spent a lot of the top of the first talking about Taiwan's mechanical changes. Walk us through this. Well, I think you have to understand first and foremost for Taiwan, what Mel Sotomayor was talking about is that his front foot was pushing forward and hitting the ground first, and then he was flying open with his shoulder. So he wanted him to get back, and you can see right here tonight on the right side of your screen how he's turned back in a little bit, trying to give him a little more time to stay together so that when he pushes off and that foot comes and hits the ground, see his, his, on the left how the foot is on the ground early and his, right, or his left foot on the right side is still in the air. That's giving his arm a chance to catch up. And then you can see how high his glove was. That's trying to get him back down the line as opposed to flying open. So there's a lot going on right there in a short amount of time for Taiwan since his last start to try to put all of that together. And we saw it in the first with a couple of walks where he struggled, especially on the pitches that were up in the zone. But he started to make some adjustments with it. And I think that's that's where they're starting right now. They also talked about his glove on, when he starts to separate having his, his left his glove on his left hand to get a little bit higher than where it was before it was dropping right away. Um, and he's so he's trying to put all those things together and pitch in a major league game against a against very good the lineup. Best team in the yeah. league. So it's, it's a, if there's a lot there. But if he can get through I think a few innings and start to gain some confidence after the two walks was able to get out of that inning. And what all of this is doing is, is again it's giving him some reference points to where he can go back and look at video in between innings or see if, he, if he's struggling a little bit and he has two three maybe even four things that he can check on to make sure that he's hitting all those spots where previously he wasn't sure and so he couldn't fix it during the game because he wasn't sure what he was doing and what he should be doing right. So Mel has really worked hard with him over the last four days to try to get him to this point. If you add up all the changes Mike how big of a change overall do you see these mechanics being for Taiwan. This is this is not like a guy breaking down a swing and tearing it down to the studs but how do you view the overall scope of this. Well if you consider that Taiwan had thrown a baseball off the mound the same way as Moreland hits into the ship no problem for Canal for a number of years Aaron this is breaking it down. Really is it that, is that far down. There, this is a lot to deal okay. with. When you start talking about from the ground up and you see the turn and the higher knee kick that he has going on to get his timing towards home and sitting back on his backside and a little turn in and then with his glove movement and then trying to keep his front shoulder in there's a lot going on there. And when you've thrown a baseball off the mound the same way for a number of years and now you're making this change there, there's a lot it gives you an idea of what a good athlete he is. To, to be able to just a couple of flat ground sessions the one bullpen session and bang you're in a game against one of the best teams in the major leagues and that's that's difficult.